Good day to everyone. I'm Mad Wantawad and welcome to another video here at Padodol Channel. For today's video, we are going to show you the beginnings of a greenhouse somewhere here in Pampanga. So we just delivered a new 3 meter diameter uh, fish tank for a commercial system. Now let's look at the land prep area. So they are now uh, leveling the ground for the greenhouse. So that will be the new greenhouse for uh, this commercial aquaponics. boards for the greenhouse so that will be the whole uh, greenhouse area the the commercial greenhouse is approximately 20 meters in width and 30 meters in length so now they are using heavy equipment uh, to make sure that the area is leveled no? so the area around there is a high point and the area around here is a low lower uh, elevation so they're making sure the, the whole thing is leveled. So follow me here. So those are the steel uh, beams. Here they have the steel beams they will use for the structure of the greenhouse. So uh, those are just the beams and uh, next week they will deliver the post no, for the greenhouse. So uh, they make they made sure that they use a uh, high quality steel so that the structure can withstand the high winds here during typhoons. So follow me. So now let us uh, help the maid team to lower the three meter tank. No? Uh, we have uh, guide wires or guide ropes to make sure that the tank will roll uh, slowly down the ramp here. No? So let's begin. Uh, they team begin uh, the roll. Right. Okay, slowly lower. 
So here we have uh, the temporary location. Thank you, Mr. Uh, for the help. So these are the temporary location for the tanks. So we have here the three meter diameter tanks. Uh, this three meter diameter tank is uh, 6,000 liters in capacity. So we have four, we have one here. Another one here. And uh, two more at the back, no? So we have two more at the back there. And we also have the eight nursery uh, grow beds we'll use to start the nursery for the commercial system. And here we have uh, the vortex brewer. So these are four uh, vortex brewers. Uh, the vortex brewers will uh, brew or make compost tea from the fish waste in the aquaponic in the aquaponics uh, DuraFlow filter max. So this is one of the DuraFlow filter max. And then uh, here we have the other two uh, fish tanks. No? So in a few months time, uh, they will be, the greenhouse will be finished and slowly we will add the, or install the system one by one. No? So maybe in two months, uh, the whole system will be up and running no so to recap again we have the greenhouse over there so the greenhouse is uh, leveled or the the layout is uh, leveled uh, using a uh, heavy equipment and then uh, the greenhouse dimension is approximately 20 meters by uh, 30 meters and uh, here we have uh, four fish tanks, four large uh, fish tanks, fish tank number one, fish tank number two, fish tank number three, and then fish tank number four over there, no? So, fish tank number two, uh, fish tank number one, two, three, and four are all 6,000 liter fish tanks. And then we have eight uh, grow beds here. So, the, the, there's already rainwater collecting, but to make sure there's, there are no mosquito, mosquitoes, we are temporarily growing duckweed in it, no? So it will cover the uh, cover the grow bed with duckweed, no? and you can use that duckweed into uh, feeding the fish. No? So we are also in a mango orchard over here. So in the future, when we have excess sludge produced here in the vortex brewer, we can uh, help fertilize the mango trees by using the excess uh, fish sludge uh, from the facility. Okay. And of course, uh, the DuraFlow filter uh, will filter out all the solids produced by the fish. And then from the DuraFlow filter, the exit or the sludge uh, drain of the DuraFlow filter will go to our uh, vortex brewer over here. Though. So we have uh, one DuraFlow filter for each fish tank uh, and one uh, vortex brewer for each uh, fish tank. Though. And then we have two uh, nursery grow beds for each uh, fish tank. So that's a total of four systems in one uh, big greenhouse. No? So if you have uh, questions about aquaponics, again we have a YouTube channel uh, Madodel. Uh, we also have our Facebook uh, page uh, Modular Aquaponics. You can uh, comment there or comment on this video if you have uh, questions about uh, anything to do with commercial aquaponics and uh, back in aquaponics in general no? so we will update you in the build of this uh, we will try to uh, video the build of this uh, commercial system so we will have an idea on what what it takes to build a commercial system uh, a commercial aquaponics system here in the Philippines no? so we are in uh, Pampanga uh, this is at the foot of uh, Mount Arayat uh, so the temperature here is uh, conducive for growing uh, uh, colder climate uh, vegetables so in the future we will try uh, colder climate vegetables uh, grown here in the no? so again I uh, if you're not subscribed yet subscribe to the YouTube channel Madodo don't forget to hit the notification bell so you get updated on our future videos and I leave you now with a, a view of all the equipment here and the uh, work uh, growing or work uh, happening at the greenhouse area so again, thank you for watching.